Hey y'all, welcome back and happy Saturday. So today we are going to be doing some pastrami sandwiches, homemade my way. Okay, so we got some pastrami right here. This is a 14 ounce pack. We got some smoked flavor uh, provolone. That's what it is. Yes, y'all. I love me some provolone, y'all. Okay, and we're going to have some salt and pepper. And this is to your taste, okay? And we're also going to make the pastrami sandwiches with these cheddar cheese. Uh, what do they call Like hoagie bread, I want to say. Yeah, it's called a gourmet hoagie, bur hoagie bread. Okay, so I'll be right back with y'all. Okay, y'all, and I forgot one more thing, y'all. We got we're gonna use this garlic powder, and these are hoagie bread. That's what it is. Hoagie buns, actually, hoagie buns. All right, y'all, be right back. Okay, y'all, I'm about to go ahead and put some onions, red bell peppers, and green pepper peppers, y'all. Y'all know I love my vegetables. I gotta get them going. I'm just gonna saute them a little bit. Let me go ahead and get them up in here. I'm putting them in some butter, y'all. Okay, they already pre-cut. This is what I do. I pre-cut my stuff so it can be ready to go. Okay? So we're going to do about three hoagie sandwiches. So this should be about enough. And y'all going to see what I'm going to do with this. Just stick around. And y'all going to see what I'm going to do. Alright y'all. Be right back. Okay y'all. So I'm adding about a hand. What is that? A teaspoon? teaspoon of salt this is my garlic I'm, you know I love my garlic y'all that's some garlic powder I'm adding in and I'm adding some pepper okay so we're gonna go ahead and get that we're gonna saute something that down and let the flavors come together let me go ahead and get me something to move this around with y'all hold on I'm right here y'all yeah, baby. We got this in this butter, y'all. We're going to get this sauteed up. We're going to let it do its thing, okay? So, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me some comments down below on what y'all making for Saturday night uh, dinner. Okay? I'll be back with y'all in a minute. Okay, y'all. I want to show y'all how I do my pastrami. Now this pastrami, y'all, is already done. So what I'm doing is just adding some flavor to it, okay? With my own little twist, okay? So we're just going to toss some salt and pepper and garlic. We're going to toss some salt and pepper and garlic powder up in here okay that's what we're gonna do to our pastrami we're gonna waken up them flavors y'all okay let me go ahead and toss it so it won't stick so i got this on a medium heat and i'm about to just go ahead and work them flavors right on in like so it's gonna be a juicy delicious hold on y'all Okay, y'all. So I'm, I'm um getting this meat together here. It's some pastrami already cooked. I'm just making it delicious. Okay, and I um added some. Already added some pepper. I added some garlic. I'm gonna add some garlic powder. I'm gonna add some garlic powder to that. Just a pinch. Now, y'all, y'all can make y'all own, but this right here is gonna be uh. The best. This is going to be the, 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 the best pastrami sandwich, okay? With the works. 
So stay tuned. Stay tuned. I'm about to go ahead and get these sandwiches together. Look how good this meat is looking, y'all. Yes, baby. Looking so oh I can't oh y'all this smells so good and I only added just some, some a little bit of salt pepper and some garlic okay garlic powder this is smelling so good y'all oh you know what I'm missing y'all I'm missing my lemon pepper hold on y'all I knew I was missing something my lemon pepper yes baby we gotta wake up them taste for yes okay so that's what I'm gonna add a little bit of that all right y'all stay tuned okay y'all about to go ahead and put some of this country crock on my bread my hoagie bread if y'all don't use no country crock y'all know what y'all missing if y'all ain't using it there's some good stuff right here y'all and you can catch it on sale okay so this meal right here is a budget friendly meal less than twenty dollars so it is a budget friendly meal y'all okay so i'm gonna go ahead and finish putting on my butter on my bread and we're gonna throw this in the oven until it get a little crust not too much but y'all already know what butter do when you put it on any type of bread you put in the oven you know you know what it do it makes it taste crunchy yes and then we're gonna be back to feel it okay y'all i'll be back okay y'all so this is what the bread is looking like our hoagie bread hoagie buns this is what our hoagie buns is looking like so i'm about to go ahead and throw them in the oven and i'll be back Okay, y'all. I'm gonna put these in the oven, our hoagie breads. All right, y'all. I'm gonna sprinkle a little parsley on my bread. Like so. Okay, y'all. So I'm gonna sprinkle some, uh, sprinkle some parsley on the bread. Now I'm about to go ahead and add my meat. Make sure your hands is clean. Wash your hands. Because you got to use your hands to do this, okay? Alright, so we're going to do it like so. And we're going to do this other one. Like so. We're just going to stuff this in there like that. Yes, baby. Look at that, y'all. There's some good old pastrami, okay? All right, y'all. And then I'm going to do this last one. I had to do my vegetables, y'all. So I had to uh, go ahead and get that in there like so. But I ain't done yet. This one right here is going to be the works, y'all. Okay. So hold on. Let me get something to scoop this on out. Okay, like so. I'm gonna go ahead and just sprinkle the vegetables on there like that. Hold on, y'all. Be right back. Okay, y'all. I'm about to add some provolone, my favorite cheese, y'all. We're gonna put that on there like that, y'all. Y'all, watch how this cheese melts. OMG. It melts so good, y'all. So good. Let me go ahead and open this up just a little bit so we can get that in there. Yes, baby. It's the cheese part, baby. Hold on, girl. Hold on. You know what? I'm going to put... Uh, no, I'm going to put two, y'all. I was going to put three. I'm not going to overdo it. We're just going to have it just like that. And I'm going to sprinkle little parsley on that cheese like so y'all we about to put this back in the oven for about 10 minutes 10 minutes at i got it at 400 degrees 10 minutes we want this cheese to melt and i'll see y'all in a minute okay y'all take a look at these 
pastrami sandwiches these pastrami hoagie sandwiches okay yes look at that cheese baby that's that provolone yes honey okay y'all i'm gonna have to take me a bite hold on y'all let me find me something to take this out with hold on yeah. okay y'all this is the provolone i put some pickles on there hope y'all can see that this looks so good let me turn it this way that's how we're gonna do that there don't do that like that okay y'all i'm gonna take a bite hold on real quick this is gonna be a juicy situation leave it on the plate Okay, you recording it? Let me see. Okay. I ain't gonna be able to do I'm gonna have to cut it because it's crunchy. Crunchy, crunchy, crunchy. Baby, be a lady like Like, damn, who took that big ass point? <laughs> you took that big ass point? Okay. All right, y'all. Let me 